देशभक्तों के बलिदान से स्वतंत्र हुए हैं हम कोई पूछे कौन हो तो घर से कहेंगे भारतीय गुड मॉर्निंग टू वन एंड ऑल प्रेजेंट ओवर हियर आई एम मिराज डेका और मैं सोमाजिता हल्दर एंड वी लाइक टू वेलकम ईच एंड एवरी वन ऑफ यू टू सेवेंटी सिक्स इंडिपेंडेंस डे सेलिब्रेशन हियर इन नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूट टेक्नोलॉजी फ्यूचर सेवेंटी फाइव ईयर्स अगो ऑन दिस वेरी डे इंडिया वॉज रिकॉग्नाइज एन इंडिपेंडेंट नेशन a nation so a day when we remember the freedom fighters who laid down their lives for our country in the last swatantrata divas aaye azadi ke amrit mahotsav ke vichar ko barawa dene ke liye haath milaye jiska shabdik arth hai azadi ki urja ka amrit ये भारत सरकार की एक पहल है जो प्रगतिशील भारत के 75 साल और इसके लोगों संस्कृति और उपलब्धियों के गौरवशाली इतिहास को मनाने के लिए है आज़ादी का अमृत महोत्सव भारत की सामाजिक सांस्कृतिक राजनीतिक एवं आर्थिक पहचान के बारे में प्राइम मिनिस्टर नरेंद्र मोदी फाउंडेड बाय द मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ कल्चर एंड द गवर्नमेंट ऑफ इंडिया This Mahotsav officially started on 12th March 2021 which started as a countdown to our 75th anniversary of independence and will end on 15th August 2023 Missions of India under the banner of Fit India movement along with a number of inter-hostel competitions one of them being hostel cleanliness to encourage the Swachh Bharat mission later today a tree plantation drive will also be conducted to encourage the Green India mission under NAPCC Senior and Officer Ram Kinkar Singh will seek permission from today's Chief Guest, Honorable Director, and IT Soldier for parade inspection. Uh, 
सेंट्रल कमांडर सीनियर अंडर ऑफिसर राम किंकर सिंह आज के मुख्य अतिथि माननीय निर्देशक से पेरेड निरीक्षण के लिए अनुमति मांगेंगे आज एनआईडी से चढ़ के सभी छात्रवास शिक्षक सिक्योरिटी दस्ता एवं अतिथि प्रटूट परेड हेतु उपस्थित है श्रीमान परेड निरीक्षण के लिए अनुरोध है श्रीमान क्या जात है The director, NIT Silchar, is guided by Under Officer Kalpatrun Ara, Cadet Anubama Dev, Under Officer Amalindu Kumar, Company Quarters Master Sergeant Namak Tyagi. Now the director sir is inspecting the platoon of NCC Senior Division. Now, the director sir is inspecting the platoon of faculties. Now, the director sir is inspecting the platoon of girls hostel 1. Now, the director sir is inspecting the platoon of girls hostel 2. Now, director sir is inspecting the platoon of boys hostel 1 and 2. Now, we have to sir inspecting the platoon of boys or self four. Now, director sir is inspecting the platoon of boys or self six. Now, the 
to service is taking the platoon of boys was to seven. Now, director sir is inspecting the platoon of boys who serve 9 Jagdish Chandra Bose Hall. Now, the director sir is inspecting the platoon of BH9B, Srinivasan and Raman. Raman is in home. Now, directors are inspecting the platoon of Boris and Knight, CAT, CV Raman Hall, and Vikram Saravai Hall. Now, director sir is inspecting the platoon of Aryabhata Hostel. Now, director sir is inspecting the platoon of VSSS. Now the commanders of all the platoons are reporting to a senior and officer. Photo. 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 I was able to get a video of the video. I was able to get a video of the video. I was able to get a video of the video. I was able to get a video of the video. I was
Now, the Central Commander, Senior Under Officer, Ram Kinkar Singh, will seek permission from the Director and IT Searcher for parade march. Uh, Central Commander, Senior Under Officer, Ram Kinkar Singh, parade march ke liye nirdeshak and IT Searcher se anumati maangenge. Marching right towards the tires, the Central Commander, Senior Under Officer Ram Kinkar Singh, and the platoon of NCC Senior Division with the platoon commander, Under Officer Syed Indika Hussain, and flag bearer, Under Officer Saurav Chanda. Next up is the NCC Senior Wing Platoon, which is marching towards the tires under the leadership of the platoon commander, Senior Under Officer Sonali Kanu, and flag bearer Under Officer Avasi.
Lieutenant Faculty, led by the Platoon Commander Dr. Ramanujam E. and Flag Bearer Dr. Jivanjot Singh is now approaching towards the dais. देख सकते हैं जो कि प्लेटून कमांडर 
अंकित कुमार दास एवं ध्वज बाहर प्रिंस कुमार सिंह के नेतृत्व तो में आगे बढ़ रही है Marching right towards the dais is a platoon of Boys Hostel 7 with the platoon commander Pankaj Kumar Meena and flag bearer Sagar Verma. अभी हम डाइस के पास छात्रावास आठ को देख सकते हैं जो कि प्लेटून कमांड प्लेटून कमांडर एमडी हजारों जमान एवं ध्वज बाहक प्रिंसिप कुमार के नेतृत्व में आगे बढ़ रही है। The platoon of Boys Hostel 9A, Jagdish Chandra Bose Hall, led by platoon commander Tokishko Bhattacharji and flag bearer Gyandip Kogoy is now approaching towards the dais. अभी हम डाइस के पास छात्रावास नाइन बी को देख सकते हैं जो कि प्लेटून कमांडर दीपक कुमार एवं ध्वज बाहक के हरि कृष्ण के नेतृत्व में आगे बढ़ रही है Marching right towards the dais is a platoon of Boys Hostel 9C and D, led by platoon commander Kanhu Chakradi and flag bearer Shivam Kumar. हम डाइस के पास आर्यभट्टर छात्रावास को देख सकते हैं जो कि प्लेटून कमांडर नवीन कुमार एवं ध्वज बाहक सुधांशु सेन गुप्तो के नेतृत्व में आगे बढ़ रहे हैं
the platoon of PSSS, led by platoon commander Ek Subedar, Niharuddin Lashkar, and flag bearer Ek Savaldar, Naveen Singha, is now approaching towards the dais. छात्रों को संबोधित करने के लिए अनुरोध करना चाहते हैं। My heartfelt wishes for the 76th Independence Day of the nation to you and also I extend my warm welcome to the celebration of the day. This year and today that program is going to come to an end. On this day, when we celebrate it across the country with pride and honor, we pay our sincere homage to our brothers and sisters who sacrificed their lives and dreamed of a nation full of prosperity, wisdom, and tolerance. Today we stand up to salute our national flag and sing our national anthem with pride in our hearts. It is time to look within and rededicate ourselves to the building of the nation. And we understand that building our characters is the most important thing through which we can make ourselves ready to contribute to the building of the nation. The celebration of Har Ghar Tiranga is very symbolic. It is, it is embodiment of our commitment to nation building. It attached us a personal relation with the Tiranga and how we can contribute towards building the nation. Dear all, NIT Silchar is striving hard and thriving for excellence in all segments of academics, innovation and research framework. Already you know, but I am again happy to announce that this year in the national institution ranking framework in the engineering category from the 48th position we moved up to 38th rank. In the overall category we moved up from 93 to 76 position this time and in the second edition of the ranking for research institutions we were identified as the top 50 research institutions in the country. Obviously, at the same time, in the, we have participated in the international rankings also. But the details of each and every ranking are not that numbers are important, but what is important, I think for all of us to take note of, is the SOAC analysis. Through this ranking process, you identify your strengths, 
you identify your weakness you identify the opportunities that lie ahead of us and the challenges there should not be any word like problem in our dictionary and everything that we cannot do in the first shot that should be defined as a challenge and this swak analysis we not only do for the institution but in every human being we need to carry out this swak analysis so that we each individual can contribute towards the building of the nation our endeavor to make sustainability as a pride of our culture has helped us to rank 200 in the ui green metric ranking in the world and the fifth in the university in the country now as we all know that the education system in the country now is governed by the national education policy which was pronounced in 2020 the national education policy nep 2020 that puts its emphasis in indian ethos rooted in indian ethos and contributes directly to transforming india sustainably into an equitable and vibrant knowledge power by providing high quality education to all and while in the institution we are carrying out activities towards the implementation of nep 2020 in terms of interdisciplinary and translational research and development in the implementation of integration of indian knowledge system the traditional knowledge base with respect to our traditional with respect to the modern science and technology scenario but national education policy is not only for the higher education it is starts from the school education system as well and we are happy to note that our students also they take part they coordinate with the schools in the local region in the five adopted villages modutila babutila pokitila bharakai and gongur they interact with the school children in those villages they uh, do the teaching there and at the same time under rashtriya avishkar obhiyan we also look into the aspects of research and innovation at the school level also so as a higher educational institution we have not only the responsibility to look for upliftment of the higher education in terms of the national education policy but also look into the implementation of national education policy for the school education as well in the area of national education policy 2020 among many other things we have introduced interdisciplinary courses post graduate courses and we are the only one nit in the country who have introduced a doctoral program for mbbs doctors as well so that they can now register in the nit silchar and carry out their research activity in collaboration with our faculty members the envision atmanirbhar bharat that created a revolution of indian manufacturing and startup system and recently we have received a support from department of science and technology for setting up of a inclusive technology business incubator under the vertical of digital technologies and we had a innovation center incubation center earlier and with this new support we understand this thrust on the innovation and entrepreneurship will take a new turn now the realization of self resilience has to be inclusive and conducive much like the announcement of our honorable prime minister as sabka sath sabka vishwas ve sabka vikas we have established science technology and innovation hub in nit silchar for the socio economic upliftment of sc st community in assam we reached out to the underprivileged students of the villages 
through our Gyan Sagar, the social welfare wing of the institution. To consolidate our endeavor for the objectives of self-reliance or Atma Nirvarata, we work with Ministry of Small, Micro, Small and Medium Enterprise and Khadi Village and Industries Corporation to act as mentor for MSME and the KVIC sectors and to work and to build some indigenous products from sustainable materials such as bamboo and other composites. In the focus on uh, the making toy industry in India by our Honorable Prime Minister, so we also participated in the toy cathon and one of the finals of the toy cathon 2021 was organized by NIT Silchar and three of our teams with were selected for the Toy Cathon 21 final and finale and they received the applauses. Sustainability is a key word in the present context and when we talk about sustainability, we put focus on the environment as well. Our Eco Club, the students and the faculties and the staff members themselves over the years they have made the campus a greener campus and sustainability as a key one. We are working on a project, sustainable energy system for achieving novel carbon neutral energy communities, sustenance, which is funded by Department of Science and Technology and European Union. As all of us know, we have a one megawatt solar power plant on the hostel rooftops and the academic buildings, which supports around 30% of our energy requirement. And we strive to make it 50% by 2030, satisfying the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals. Our thrust for sustainability that encouraged us to organize the 6th Northeast Green Summit at NIT Silchar in 2021, in which Honorable Minister of State, Ministry of Environment, Forest and Climate Change, Government of India, Sri Oshini Chaubeji, Member of Parliament, Silchar Lok Sabha Constituency, Dr. Rajdeep Roy, Minister of State, Ministry of Education, Dr. Rajkumar Ranjan Singh and many others were present during this program. And we are happy to inform you that NIT Silchar is one of the hosts for the next edition of the Northeast Green Summit. Under Satchota Bharat Abhijan, we celebrated 15 day long Satchota Pakhavara and in the coming September 1 to September 15, we will be having the next edition of the Satchata Pakhwara. And as we all know that we do not only do the Satchata Pakhwara during the specified uh, uh, two weeks of the year, but we also practice the Satchata Pakhwara, Satchata cleanliness in all its letter and spirit. As part of this Harghar Tiranga campaign, one of the important uh, competitions among the hostels were the hostel cleanliness drive in which individual hostel rooms they are, were inspected by our judges and we understand that this kind of cleanliness drive in the hostels also in the hostel rooms will be carrying out in the near future as well. Apart from education, sports and games is an important component in an academic institution and many of our students, they have brought laurels to the country. We are happy to note that in November this year, we are going to host the Inter-NIT tournament for both men and women in badminton, table tennis and chess. We organize the Fit India Freedom Run for both men and women, boys and girls also. Each year, with Ekta Dur, cycle rallies, we engage ourselves to disseminate the benefits of sports and games in creating a healthy and wise life. 
and we understand that every year on 8th of March when we organize the International Women's Day, we organize a cricket match between girls, students and the faculty and staffs. It is not only a one-day event because for a team game it requires a practice. So this over the years has become a signature event in the calendar of National Institute of Technology, Silchar. As an institution, we always perform our duties and responsibilities in all dimensions. We participated in all the government initiatives such as Gati Shakti, Sapka Sat, Sapka Vikas, Sapka Vishwas, Aushman Bharat, Actis Policy, Make in India, National Education Policy 2020, Beti Bachao, Beti Parao, Jal Jibar Mission, Digital India, Skill India Movement, and others. Under Ek Bharat, Shrest Bharat, we are paired with NIT Joypur and we adopted Rajasthani language for various events in the institutions. And we organize food festivals which basically demonstrates the Ek Bharat, Shrest Bharat culture to its fullest extent. And today also, as part of the Har Ghar Tiranga celebration as part of Ajadi Kaumbrit Mahotsav, we have the food festival program also where the student groups are also participating. We organize International Mother Language Day since 2018. We have completed mass vaccination drive for 100% vaccination of our faculty, staffs and the students. NIT Silchar has emerged as one of the most promising technical institutions, not only in the Northeast, but in the country as well. And we are happy to note that we have a good number of international students as well. And among the NITs, that is one of the respectable number of international students. And today, <coughs> I am happy to say that many of our international students from the hostels, they have taken part in the parade for the Independence Day celebration at NIT Silchar. As an institute, we must bring the best out of every individual, but at the same time, we are not going to tolerate any kind of indiscipline that even the slightest chance to malign its reputation. It takes years to build the reputation of an institute. It takes years to maintain it, but it takes only moments, basically, to malign the reputation of an institution. I am extremely happy to see that our faculty members, students are putting their best efforts in bringing laurels to the institute. And I am certain that they shall continue their best effort for the benefit of the institute as well as for the country. I would like to assure all the employees of this great organization that we place equal value to the services of each individual and request them to consider this as a personal acknowledgement and appreciation of their individual contributions. On this auspicious occasion of the 76th Independence Day of India, let us resolve that we shall put our sincere effort in bringing glory to the Institute and contribute towards societal development with dignity, accountability, and integrity. I shall end my speech by quoting Swami Vivekananda. He said, and I quote, I have faith in my country, and especially in the youth of my country. All power is within you, and you can do anything and everything. I think over the years, what NIT Silchar fraternity students, scholars, faculty members, staff members, they have started believing that we can do it and we have been able to do and we are in the path of doing much more also. With this, I take your thoughts once again to the immeasurable sacrifice made by your freedom fighters and national leaders who are instrumental in making India an independent nation. I acknowledge the efforts of 
faculties, administrative staff in raising above the bar and working relentlessly for the institute along with our students and scholars. The road ahead is going to be challenging. Retaining our position at various levels is the most important part and that requires your continuous effort and support. And I am sure we shall be able to rise up to the occasions, expectations of the nation and ride over the up upcoming challenges with our skill, expertise, wisdom and dream work. Thank you. Joy him. Professor Shivaji Bandopadhyay, sir, for parade pictures. Uh, Central Commander, Senior Under Officer Ram Kinkar Singh, Director Professor Shivaji Bandopadhyay, sir, parade. कमेटी को मोमेंटो प्रदान करें। और एवं डायरेक्टर प्रोफेसर शिवाजी बंदोपाध्याय सर, टू गिव द मोमेंटोस टू आवर ज्यूरी मेंबर्स। First up, I'll be giving the memento to Subedar Jasbir Singh from 3 Assam Battalion. Next, I'd like to request our Honourable Director, Professor Shivaji Pondopadhyay, sir, to give Havaldar Sanjeev Jadav from 62 Assam Girls Battalion the momentum. Now, I'd like to request Honourable Director, Professor Shivaji Pondopadhyay, sir, to give the momentum to Naib Subedar Sanjay Kumar from 3 Assam Battalion. <laughs> <laughs> 